everybody, Tina Williams here, and on behalf of myself and the amazing Trish Gillum from Bold Angels Enterprises, we want to help you filter the noise. Many of you we hear on a regular basis complain because you're distracted by noise, particularly in your inbox. And with Google Plus being so big, I know many of you are part of many communities, including ours, not only are your inboxes getting bombarded with Google Plus notifications, but on top of that, you're seeing your regular promotions, your regular emails, and even if you use multiple different Gmail accounts, same story, different place. So we're going to show you how to cut out some of that noise and filter it so you can focus. Are you ready? Let's go to Gmail. Okay, we're going to pop into my Gmail. This is my KLT coach. This is one of my main Gmails, and I know many of you have it already, but as you can see, I have some very cool tabs here. If you haven't seen these yet, these are the new tabs for filtering that Google has put into place. Primary is person-to-person -person conversation and messages that don't appear in other tabs. Social, as you can see, I got 88 new tabs in here. The social one is messages from social network sharing, media sharing sites, online dating services. Luckily, you're not going to see any of those in my social box here, and other social websites. And then promotions, deals, offers, and other marketing emails. Now, if you click here to this tab, you'll see that you also have an opportunity to get updates. And updates is personal auto-generated updates, including confirmations, receipts, bills, statements, things like that. And it's giving me some examples of what Google or Gmail thinks from its um, own algorithms and its own machine learning systems that should be in my updates and then in forums. So it's telling me some of the forums I may be part of and if I were to tick these and I'll show you, I'll give you an example and include start in primary so I want you to see that where I can star things to actually push it to my primary and I can click that and you'll see here as soon as it's done loading that I have two other tabs that will start popping up. You see how updates and forums and my primary tab got um, filtered even more? Now here's the one I want you to look at. Social. Many, many, many of you, especially those of you who are new with Affiliate HD, you're seeing so much noise from the Affiliate HD community, and it's not noise, I'll tell you, it's great content, but it could make you a little crazy. Uh, I'm actually going to show you an example with famous quotes, because talk about noise, I'm going to show you a little bit later in this video how to actually filter some of those notifications as well. But you'll see how nicely in my inbox all of this is placed into this social tab. Promotions. Now, good news and bad news about promotions. Cleans my inbox out so everything that Google has considered a promotion is put under this tab. For those of us who are marketers, that's why using other tools such as Skype, the new uh, groups functionality that's being taught in Affiliate HD, is going to make a huge difference. And then updates, you can see it's bounced updates in here, and forums. So you can move these around. You can't move these tabs around, but what you can do is, for instance, if I wanted um, a size and style loaded, if I wanted to move Tim Jordan to, say, promotions, I can drop and drag Timothy over to promotions, and he'll be considered promotions. Now, if I was in, um, let's go back to promotions, and let's say I want to make sure that the 100 day challenge is going to show up in my primary starred things as you just saw will pop up in my primary so if I star that it's going to bring that over to primary so you have a couple of different ways to change the engagement style here. Now for those of you who want to get that and you can see the conversation has been moved or I can undo it. Um, do this for future messages from Google Plus Platform Review. I'm just going to leave this right now and I'm going to actually get out of that. How do I get that? 
let's pop on over to one of our other Gmail accounts and let's do this. You hop over here to where the settings are. You're going to go right down here to configure. Voila! Select tabs to enable. So I only need right now for these, these three tabs, but all I have to do is go like that, watch that baby load, and welcome to your new inbox. Mail is organized by category and shown in tabs, and it'll walk me through that. So, okay, got it. Now you can see that Google is welcoming me, the Gmail team, to the new inbox, and I'm ready, set, go. And you can see they've already started in our Bold Angels 212 Gmail. That's the main one that all of you get if you are connecting with Trish and myself at Bold Angels 212. So you can see we have fixed this baby on up so that some of that noise here is automatically filtered right on in. So another way to do this. I think this is the coolest way to do it from a user perspective. As a marketer, <laughs> I could definitely still tell you the jury's still out on that one, but as a user, this definitely helps. Little bit different now. Let's talk about another way to do that because many, many, many of you are a little concerned about the noise from offers. Now it's great that it's all popped up into promotions, but maybe say in this promotions area, you don't want to see all these promotions. You want just to filter some of them. So I'm going to scoot on down here, if I can, to Tina and Trish. That's us. We want to make sure that we, you can take a peek at the things that we have. So I'm going to show you this with using us as an example. You can further filter your particular offers and the offers that happen to come from Trisha and myself, especially for those of you who are in a new product like Affiliate HD because we want you concentrating on that because it's an investment and we want to make sure that your focus is in there. So use filters for focus. However, we usually are very focused and we filter the offers we bring to you so we want to make sure you don't miss them either remember you can always ask us we're there to help you you got angels on your shoulder so if you want to further filter Trish and myself's offers what you can do is simply this you can go to any one of our offers click this little more button right here filter messages like this and you can stick Trish and me in a folder create a filter with this search and as you can see you can actually ask it to skip the inbox directly or just apply a label to it so you can especially if you have enabled the tabs you don't have to worry about it as much but you could have it just skip the inbox directly either way you want to apply a label so you can choose a label and even create a new one and Tina and Trish. Now, this is the main folder. So, nestled under tab, we don't particularly have one. And I'm going to put Tina and Trish offers. Or how about emails? Email. Okay, so, because I want to show you something else. And I'm going to create this. So, I have created a filter and I can also apply that to all other matching conversations. So I'm going to actually create that filter and you'll see we have been filtered and now we will be a folder and you can see it'll create a folder for Tina and Trish. I have to go in and grab that for you. See? We are now a folder! So everything pops up in here. Now I want to show you something just a little bit different and in addition to how you can further filter your folders. For those of you who are in our Productivity Results Workshop, you're getting two emails a day from us. You're getting one in the morning and one in the evening. Now. Here's the thing about this. We want you getting those emails. We want them in your inbox because as you can see, day 23, good morning. We want you getting these 
wake up calls to get you motivated and to schedule your money generating activities. And then we have our evening emails that put you to bed inspired. So we want you to be able to see them, but if you are finding that they are cluttering your inbox or maybe you're not getting to them because they're getting lost among everything else, what you can do is you can further filter this. You see how it's coming from a different Gmail address? Watch. You can filter messages like this create the filter here and you can apply the label and watch what I can do. I can actually choose the label Tina and Trish email and what I can do here is I can further nestle it. Let me see if it'll allow me to do that. What I'm going to need to do is create a new label and it'll be TNT Productivity and see nestle under label and I can select a parent label of Tina and Trish. So I can create that and apply to all matching conversations. Voila! Now when I go here and I go to Tina and Trish you're gonna see that we have some options in here to go to check our emails out and we've got us filtered and then we have a sub filter which will be our Productivity Results Workshop. It's not playing with me nicely here. So that little arrow there will open our label up and you got TNT Productive. Pretty cool, huh? So you can filter out the noise, no worries. Now one more filter I want to show you. Right up here in your Google Plus account, you have notifications. You can see I have some notifications here. And if you want to further filter these notifications, all you simply need to do is one of two things. If I want to go to a community, and as I showed you, I was getting a lot, a lot, a lot of notifications from, although I love it, the famous quotes. You can see 99 notifications already, and you can do this with us as well. All you have to do is, you see where it says notifications on? Stop notifications for new posts. Get notifications. See that little bell? Stop them. Get them. Stop them. Get them. Stop them. Get them. <laughs> so I'm actually going to turn them off for right now because they're getting a little overwhelming. Or scroll down here. And you can go into your account. And just like in Facebook, Receive notifications is right here. Notify me by email or SMS when someone, and what you can do is you can filter what you get notified on. It's quite simple. And you can filter through and you can change these so you don't get emails every time you get a new activity going on. So it's totally up to you. You are in control. Do not let noise break your concentration and mess with your focus. Filter so you can focus and enjoy the experience. We will see you in the next video. Thank you and be careful filtering Trish and me too much. Have a great day. We'll see you in the next video.